If you recall, it's a three-step process, one, two, and three, over the three years of your residency. With the first one being an introduction to community medicine and really what that means. There's some experiential play there, but you really it's more about reading, listening, looking, going on a tour, really getting a sense of what your community that you are uh, working in is all about, and then also what this idea of community medicine is all about. This year, then, your second year, the idea is to put some of that theory into practice and to get out there, roll up your shirt sleeves a little, and see how community medicine actually happens. Uh, and you'll do that in a number of venues. And then next year, the third year, you go a little deeper. You, again, uh, revisit some uh, programs where community medicine is happening, but you really take on your own interest. And if you have a particular population or a particular program that it is of interest to you, you revisit that again and maybe go a little deeper over several sessions there, as well as some more directed reading. So in a nutshell, that's how the three longitudinal months are structured. Obviously, because the way an intern's uh, schedule works and a second year schedule works and a third year schedule works, it might be some time between these rotations. It might be greater than a year, 18 months, even longer between uh, your ambulatory rotation. So I appreciate if there's some cobwebs building uh, around what you did as an intern. So I'll take a moment and uh, review.